God, he looks so gross from back there. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. <laughs> Playing Silent Hill, the first, the one and only. Let's pull out of this I'm an easy fellow. Oh man, I have not played this game in eons, eons. I must have been like, jeez, like ten when I played this game. God, those old PS1 era graphics. Oh yeah, that slow running man walk. God, look at the polygons. Big old pixelated text. <laughs> it's quiet. Too quiet. This place is like a ghost town. Gerald. Look at all those pretty snowflakes. What if I can get it? the old tank controls. Hmm? Footsteps. He's moving on his own. I don't have to touch the controller. Is that my wife? What the hell is wrong with you? Yeah, that looks like a wife. Cheryl? Is that Cheryl? What the hell is wrong with you? Lighter, kiddo. Where are you going? No, Cheryl, come Hey, back. wait! Stop! I'm coming for you. You can't have me. difference between Siren and Silent Hill's tank controls, but Silent Hill's tank controls feel right. I don't go like a little bit off the edge of, of, of the analog stick and suddenly freaks the frig out. What the? What is this? Can't go there. You hear the same faint sound of sirens in the background. God, these pixelated graphics just... It feels so good to be back in PS1 era. Just video games again. I might some play some Final Fantasy Tactics after this, who knows? Man, I love the PS1. I love the PS2. PS3 didn't get, PS4 didn't get. After the PS2, I kind of became a PC era guy. Just kind of worked out that way. I got a PC, and then I got a whole bunch of PC games, and then I couldn't really afford another console, so... I guess that's just how it works. Man, I was playing Siren. Oh, hey, cutscene. That's strange. It's getting darker. Better than nothing, I guess. Oh, it's getting spooksville in here. Yeah, I remember as a kid, I, like, had some serious problems, uh... Oh, so, uh, wheelchair. Broke the wheelchair? What's this doing? Yeah, I had some problems with Siren because I didn't realize... I, I went into it completely blind and I didn't realize like it was nothing but escort missions and not fun ones at that. Unkillable, unkillable enemies also get to me. I don't really like that concept in games. Oh, these camera angles. So yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be playing another round of Forbidden Siren. You guys can tell me if you really, really want me to do it. I'll try to be doing another part two, but not that. I like had 10, 11 attempts at that fourth mission inside, and I just don't want to do it. 
It's just not something I see myself being able to do. What is this? Ooh. What's going on here? That music really kicked in. What's going on? What's this doing here? Oh god, it's the children! Get out of here, Harry! Get out of here, you dang old dude! Oh god. Run, Harry, run! I'm stuck. Am I dead? Oh god, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Kids fell over themselves. Uh oh. I feel sneeze. Ah, I feel it. Jesus, yeah, oh, it's stuck in there. Ugh. Mm, hello, pretty lady. It's tickling. Was I dreaming? How do you feel? Jeez, it took like a minute and a half. <coughs> oh, like like I've been run over by a truck. But I'm alright, I guess. He's alright, he guesses. Glad to hear it. You from around here? Why don't you tell me what happened? Wait a second, I'm just a tourist. God, he looks so gross from back there. <laughs> I came here for a vacation. I just got here. I don't know what happened. I'd like to find out myself. It sounds like that Twin Peaks song. Just a few of those ones. Uh-huh. That low bass. Have you seen a little girl? Yeah. Just turned seven last month. Short, black hair. My daughter. Sorry. The only person I've seen in this town is you. Why are you Where here? Where is everybody? I'd tell you if I knew, believe me. But from what I can tell, something bizarre is going on. Wow, really? That's all I know. Hmm. That's great. What's your name? Harry. Harry Mason. Ooh. Sybil Bennett. Ah. I'm a police officer from Brams, the next town over. Okay, I guess that explains what you're doing here. The phones are all dead, and the radio too. I'm going back to call in some reinforcements. Nice. Hmm. Man, it looks like your next just. Uh... Hold it. Oh wow, well, it really didn't change. Where do you like think you're going? Chain. My daughter. I've got to find her. No way. It's dangerous out there. In that case, I need to find her now. Cheryl's my little girl. I can't just leave her out there by herself. Mm. Have you got a gun? No. Um, no. Take this, and hope you don't have to use it. You hey, random citizen I just met. Take my now own firearm. Oh, police officer, I don't need it. Before you pull the trigger, know who you're shooting. <laughs> Your face. And don't do it unless you have to. <laughs> and don't go blasting me by mistake. Got it? What's that face you're making? Yeah, thanks. I just don't get it. You do best to stay nearby. I'll be back with help as quick as I can. Nice. I took her only gun. Is that. Yeah, no, that's not the map. That's the map. Health drink, yeah, I'll take that. Uh, flashlight. Yes. There's a residential area map. Do I take it? Sweet. Oh, hey. Big boy, just... I saw you, big boy. I saw you flipping out there. I got a gun! Don't mess with me! 
Let's check out that pinball machine. Pinball machine. Nothing unusual. Okay. You don't want to play the pinball machine? I mean, I know your white or your daughter's in trouble, but like, oh hey, cool. Uh, I'm gonna pick up that good stuff. There's a health drink. Take it. Yes. There's a kitchen knife. Do I take that? Yes, I do. Now, I know... I, I, I see the radio right there, but I'm going to save it for the most iconic line in all of Silent Hill. <laughs> What's that? Huh. Radio. radio. What's, What's going, going on, on with that, that radio? radio? What's going on with that radio? Bam, son! I'll shoot you! Stupid skin pterodactyl! This is not a dream! What's happening to this place? Bad stuff. Why did the under other window break, though? That's my question. Let's see why this other window broke. Look like there's an explanation. No, not not gonna explain it to us. What does that poster say, anyways? Study, damn it! <laughs> I, I mean, it's a good message. You should study. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything around here. Could I still inspect this dude? No, unspectable. Alrighty then, let's go over here and check out what this little doodad does. Someday, someone may experience these bizarre events. Hopefully, they, they will find my notes useful. Day one in Silent Hill. I lost my daughter. I couldn't find her. I tried to look for her, but a whole bunch of naked children with knives came towards me and stabbed me to death until I found myself inside of this... <laughs> strange diner. After which my friend, the cop, Sybil, gave me her only firearm and then I went off to kill a skin <laughs> pterodactyl. Someone's gonna find that very helpful. You know, especially James Sunderland. He's gonna find those notes for sure and be like, yep, that's, that's what I need to do. Perfect. Cafe. Is it okay to overwrite the save file? Yes. Now saving. And the save is finished. You know, I think that's actually enough for one episode. I know we're running about two minutes short, but who really gives a heck about that one? Um, yeah, let's get this ready to rip her and go, and, uh, you know I'll be playing more Silent Hill. I don't know if I'll be playing more Forbidden Siren. I mean, I really didn't like that game, so, eh. But uh, you guys will definitely see me on the next episode of Silent Hill. I'm hoping to make a full series out of this. One, two, and three. And possibly Origins. Who knows? We might, we might, we might do that. So uh, leave in the comments if you want to see any other PS2, PS1 era games done. Uh, otherwise, I think that's it for uh, today's episode. And uh, I will check all of you in the next one. So uh, stay classy out there, fellas. Uh, don't get hit by any of those guys. Bye. Love you. See you. Yeah. Yeah, you look so gross back there.